Hi, my name is Chad. I'm the owner of InternetPrepper.com. Today I'm going to show you what you get when you order the water filter kit and how to assemble it. When you get it in the mail, it'll come in a box just like this one. When you unpack it, you'll find the ceramic filter, the pre-filter sock, and a water spigot. When it's all put together, it'll look like something like this. Two buckets, water filter in the top one, with a hole drilled down to the top to the bottom. Dirty water filters through, clean water comes out the bottom, and you let it out with the spigot. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and start our project. I bought these two water buckets at Lowe's. I think they're about five dollars each. What you want to do is put the lid on the bottom and center the bucket on the top. You can use a knife or whatever you have available. Uh, you want to make an approximately uh, a, five, a, um, a half inch hole. Um, so what I've got is a bit and I'll just go ahead and drill right through here. And now we'll assemble the water filter. What you want to do is, it comes with two uh, rubber washers. Leave one on and take the other and off. And push it through. Put the water, put that, uh, that rubber gasket on the bottom part. And then hand tighten the nut. Now you don't want to be Superman when you're putting this together. You'll squish the rubber washer and defeat the purpose. But you get that hand tight just so it starts to bulge out a little bit and you're good to go. Um, the next step is to drill a hole for the spigot. To do that, you'll need a three quarter inch bit or you could use a pocket knife or whatever you've got. Um, you want to center this about an inch or so up from the bottom. Um, that way it can set level on a counter without the spigot um, interfering. So I'll go ahead and drill this now. We'll open the spigot from the bag. Again, you've got the spigot, two rubber washers, and a uh, plastic nut. So the way you want to do this is one of these filters, or one of the one of the spigots. Let me start that over again. The spigot has uh, a rubber washer that's concave, and then it's got a flat one. Uh, I don't believe it matters which way you do it, um, but I like to put the concave part um, up against the bucket on the outside. So we'll just go ahead and put that through the hole. Add the rubber washer on the inside and then hand tighten the plastic nut. Put it back together and that's about it. We've just created a water filter, a gravity fed water filter that will filter 15 to 20 gallons of water. Uh, every day, you can use lake water, stream water, runoff water, um, basically any water source will clean it and make it drinkable. My next video will show how to, uh, or how I do that. Uh, thanks for watching. You can buy this at internetprepper.com. Thanks.